I'm just really happy that I do actually have 60 arrows now, though. So good! Oh, and speaking of so good... Looks like this is actually real treasure for once. I don't know... Is it, like, right here? I'll take my chances. And I got it, like, perfect. If this is just rupees, I'm gonna be very upset. So much upset in this. Well, at least I got like 20 rupees. <laughs> I broke the rupee in like into a, a one like 20th and then uh, through the rest of the pieces. This is basically how the Triforce quest started. Somebody had too much of a Triforce, you know. Sometimes you, you just have too much Triforce and then you just want to break it. Oh, and then you throw it away. That's what happened, okay? It's a legitimate thing that happened in the past. They just... I have too much Triforce. Too much power. Too much courage. Too much wisdom. And in my infinite wisdom, I broke the thing in, into many pieces. Hey, small fry. Yeah, yeah, I've heard. Da 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 ba ba sea chart. I don't know why, but every single time, I have to say it. Even though I can just pretend that I didn't. Oh, wow. These islands are very interestingly shaped and mapped. I don't know. Tell me, Smell Fry, have you ever heard? <laughs> yes, I have. Stop talking about these forks that are non existent and not that good. Okay? Ugh. They're there on that island, or at least a chart leading to them is there. Eh, uh, where is it hidden, you ask? Well, for the answer to that, you'll have to ask a gull. Uh, that's all info I have to offer. Yeah, I, I got some gulls. Don't worry. I know somebody who's a gull. At least he looks like one to me. So yeah, this is another one of those islands. Oh, wow. Yeah, this is definitely an island, all right. That's an island. Looks like I'm gonna have to fight some, uh, birds. And, uh, spit some words in the way of some beats and raps. Oh, man. How am I gonna be able to do this one? But yeah, it's a good thing that I did come to this area first, though. I just... Oh, man. Whenever I go, like, teleporting somewhere, you're gonna see that I... I almost cleared out the entire map with the fish now. There's two more down, like, into the corner south of here. Which I might want to go next, actually. Just because I, I like to clear out the place and I'm OCD. And I mean, I'm really close. Oh, I wish I wouldn't have broke the sign. It's too bad I don't have the Song of Healing here. Or else I would actually be able to fix it. Um, boom, boom, fruit. Okay, somebody just was showed a picture of uh, some explosive uh, bomb fruit things. Oh, oh! I think I found my ticket to ride through the sky using the power of a, a grappling hook. But Link has a lot of what the heck? He has a lot of different ways of traversing planes and stuff in this game. It's like different environments. Because he can fly using the power of this, and also he can, like, grab... Well, he can use a hook shot and whatever else. I really wish that that sign wouldn't have been broken. So how am I supposed to get up there? Or... There must be a reason why this place exists. Like, it has a little place to grab. Um, any more hints? Maybe if I go back onto the King of Red Lions. Or maybe I actually do need a gull. That might be a good idea. That might tell me, because he said seagull. Why else would he have said seagull? It's a hint. It's a hint to winning this area. Maybe. So if I just grab one out of the sky. Or, or maybe he was just saying, like, yeah, this is actually the place with the Great Forks in Winnipeg, but it isn't. Let's just check my, my true map. Yeah, I'm, I'm here. That's not good. Okay. So the plan here, then, is I'm gonna put a Hanoi pear on my inventory, throw it into the sky. Seagulls, save me! Okay, let's see what's up up top here. 
Okay, so there's nothing. That's good to know. So I think that maybe this is what I'm supposed to actually do in a way, just to, like, see and get a layout of the land. Oh! Or seagulls are the answer to everything! Yes! Oh no, my seagull! He's going to get attacked! No! My poor seagull, I was, I was using him to my good. I'm just happy that this is actually a real, like, this is a legitimate thing that you have to do in the game. Because I thought that the pears would be completely a waste of your time and you didn't need them. Oh no, oh no, oh no, no, no! Why do these things have to eat seagulls? Oh, why? Oh no, actually I... Ah! Save me, Link! Save me, I'm just a poor little seagull! Oh, uh, why? At least I can outmaneuver him. Okay. Looks like it's time to use some arrows. Oh no, here they come! Here they come! Bum 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 bum! Uh oh. Uh, uh, uh. Okay. And then one more for good luck. If only I can, like, shoot that high. And... Oh, I almost got him. This is totally gonna work. Dark Souls it up. Everything relates to Dark Souls. Including my ability to miss arrows. Okay, if I just shoot, like, a million arrows in that direction... I'm just gonna keep firing. Yeah, now's the time to keep firing. Go, 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 go! None of those hit him? That bird... is impenetrable. Okay, I only have two pairs left. Let's hope that Beetle is around, or... if not... I'm going to have to just get my luck. Oh, this is gonna be dangerous. Wait, do I actually... Oh, I can fly up just using that. I don't know why I didn't do that before. So I need to glide for the most part, but... Flying might be able to help me outmaneuver. Oh no, there's even more of them. Why? Okay, let's go down. Dive bomb them! They will never suspect a thing! Oh boy. If I am going to die here, I need to distract them all at once. This is, this is gonna be very epic, because at least now I know how I can flap my wings. Flap my wings and f oh, fly. Those things better come down here. They better. Or else I'm going to be losing my last pair. Oh, why? Okay, I'm gonna bomb them. Let's some, it's time to bomb some Dodongos. In other words, birds. Oh, boy. Let's do this. Okay. I think I might be able to aim that high, but probably not at the same time. <laughs> this is sort of gonna work. Scare the birds out of the sky. Ah! Are they gonna come down here and attack yet? Come on, guys. Or can I use a pair from here? So if I can, I can fire from out of my boat. Actually, that might be an even better idea. Uh... Come on! Come on! Should I just pair it up from here? And then hope that I can just come back here and it won't, like, all die? Oh, I need Beetle. I need Beetle. Beetle Adventure Racing. This is so depressing. Oh well. It's time to take my chances with my last pair. I can outmaneuver them. Hopefully. Oh, I just went into the water. That's not good. I always forget the, like, inverse controls or something. Okay. So this one I need to grab very quickly. Okay. Come on. Come on. Oh, no. Now, if only I could control Link at the same time right now. Then I would be able to... Oh, I missed. Just barely. Okay, I think I might need to make a loop around before- actually, I scared that bird off. That's not good. Yes! Okay, one more. Let's see if my flying skills are going to be winning, put to the test. Yes! And that is gull racing. 
Oh, save me, Link. Oh. Now Link is going to, oh no. He's going to save the day <laughs> by jumping out of his boat. Okay. Now, uh, uh, uh. triple hit. Or should I say, triple kill. Uh. I think I need to add some reverb to that one or something. Oh no. But also it's because it wasn't. Uh. I'm having troubles. Troubles when I'm in bird territory. Okay, but this is actually really cool that they actually gave a real use to the Hanoi pairs. That you legitimately have to use them. For this, and also I guess there is a place of the game where you do use them, but you just don't... It's not part of the main story. So, well, you know, things happen. Do I have to play my tune? Yes, it's just like Donkey Kong 64. Ah, uh, ba, ba. And also, I'm pretty sure that I did actually go to one of these places before, and I just didn't grab the <laughs> Triforce piece. Or I will, maybe I, I could have, or but I might not have been able to at the time. I don't know. Oh, there's just so many rupees, so many rupees to waste. Oh, it's so good to rub them all over myself. That's that's what I like to do with the rupees. Also, there's one in the background. You got a Triforce chart! You can't read it yourself, so you'll have to get it deciphered somewhere. Okay. No problemo. Hopefully it will be like a thousand or less. I mean, if it is a thousand, I can still deal with that. Especially since there's only like two that I have to do. But that means, I wonder if I should actually go exploring first or later then. So, I mean, I probably would want to... Actually, I'm gonna check how many... Oh, yeah, I have enough bait. Okay, I'm gonna go and check these last little couple areas down here first. As you know, while I'm in the area, and I'm probably never gonna come back down here ever again, so... Uh, yeah, because there's no other Triforce pieces here, so... That's uh, something to note. The notation of... Math and stuff dictates that there's no reason to go down here other than for the fish. Or actually, there might be something good. I don't know. There might be. You can never discount everything in the world. I'm switching those around, and then I'm gonna switch to that. Oh, man. Because I, I prefer to have my arrows on the X button for some reason. I don't know. And it's always weird having, like, X is being Y, and Y is X, and A is B, and B is A. But hey, small fry. Yeah, yeah, I've heard that you've been going down here just to feed our fish. You're very polite. That's what I like to say. But who really knows in this world in which we're living in that's all made out of ocean. And there's probably a little bit of treasure here. I'm gonna tell you more information right now. Hey, small fry. Uh, did you know that about the Nintendo Gallery? The only way in there is to hit a switch that's high up, what, that's way up high in the forest haven. But the only way to do that would be to bribe one of the gulls by putting a little bait on your head. And that's all info I have to offer. Yeah, I already figured that out. Don't worry. I figured it out. But the Nintendo Gallery, I don't know what to do from there, because it's, it's an all right place. What, what is that? Is this the forest haven? It can't be. Can it be? No, I don't believe it. I don't believe that's a forest haven, but it is, apparently. Oh, I probably should get going because there's sharks. Ow. Oh, did I just... I think I just boosted right through him. Because the game, like, they're not used to having, you know, the super fast speeds. So, <laughs> that's the thing. They didn't code it, so then when you just, like, you just ram through things. This doesn't even do any damage. Yep, that's the way it works. I totally didn't code it. Imagine if that was actually true. Who knows? I'm unraveling the secrets of Aonuma and Nintendo. Nobody wants to... Well, they don't want anybody to know. That's the main thing. Oh, there's a... This is just a, one of those, like, farms for killing the birds, I think. Speaking of which, I might actually want to farm for birds while I'm here. Because they're actually really good to farm. 
Oh, mostly because I kind of need their feathers. Oh, I got one. That's pretty good. I need, I don't know how many I actually have right now, but I'm getting close to the 20. The 20 mark that I absolutely need. Okay, there's like two more, well there's three more birds here. And a fish! The fish is actually where I need him to be. It's amazing. Also, there's a lot of rupees here probably. I'm guessing that's what this place is. It's Rupee Land. Tingle's Rupee Land. Just like uh, that game. I'm pretty sure that's what the game is called. That's the name of the game, folks. Tingle's Rupee Land. Also, I think that those pirates have been friendly firing each other a little bit. And you die. It just looks so awesome just doing the gyros, though. Using gyros in order to kill things. And just like. That's what I'm wondering. This video might actually be out by the time Splatoon's out, because Splatoon is coming very, very soon. Which, that's just all what the Splatoon is all about, as, you know, as we know. Mmm, yes. Uh, I'm gonna get double hit. But, if Splatoon actually has a different thing in the game that allows you to... ...actually... ...use gyro controls, sometimes? That might actually be really awesome. I would try it out a little bit, if nothing else. Because it's better than using the sticks, because, I mean, I don't like to use the sticks if it's not on the Pro Controller. The Pro Controller sticks are good, but other than that, nah, I don't really like the gamepad sticks too much. The, ga the sticks on Xbox One Controller is much better. Hey, small fry, did you notice all the birds around here? There's so many of them. If you grab the feathers, uh, then you can do stuff. That's pretty much all I'm going to say, probably. Oh, see, look at this. Yeah, five star aisles. And that's probably all that's here. This Have you seen it, Small Fry? The ghost ship? Because it's real. Even It's even been seen here in these very waters. On nights when the crescent moon faces down, that's when the horror rises. Oh, wow. Okay, so left is like two uh, doors up. If it's down, then it's here. If it's up, then it's over to the- okay, I think I know where, like, all of them are. You basically have to just keep going around, but that's all if I have to offer, bait me, blah 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 blah, and so on, but... Yeah, so if- you just have to pay attention to the moon. Oh, what happens if it's a full moon, though? Oh... It's so confusing. Yeah, for that one, I still need to figure out what I'm supposed to do with this ghost ship, though. That's the main thing. Oh, but I have, like... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Like, thirteen more fish to talk to. That's still a lot. That's a lot of fish. Man. But also, um... Oh, yeah, there's actually... There's probably a reason why that... Oh, no. If I actually have to help somebody in Windfall in order to get... One of the Triforce pieces, I'm gonna be very upset. Because I think that might actually be what I have to do. <laughs> for one of them, but... Um... We'll figure that out when we get there. What I want to do right now, I'm going to check. Oh, I have 18 gold feathers. I need two more. It's so close. Can I get this bird? Will he come down here and show me his love? Can I at least scare him down? Man, Link has a really hard time aiming when he's like on a boat. That's the one problem. Oh well, I'm not gonna grab that Tingle Bottle either, cuz... I say nay to Tingle Bottles! No in Swedish. Apparently. Also, what's up here? This one might be worth going to. I'll do it right before I leave, because this, this little, like... Sector... Sector wins! Fatality! And so on, but... This one area... Seems to have, like, a lot of important things. I mean, it's the islands with the birds that give you delicious treats. And, you know, this is where one of the pirate ships can be located, so... Eh, I don't know. This will probably give me nothing, but... There's always hope and time to... Just be a terrible person to these guys. Oh, he's falling to his death. Is that it? Yeah, it looks like that's the end of the watchtower here. Maybe I'm gonna check my my chart that has the watchtowers on it. The platform chart, yeah, there's one platform here, but it doesn't actually tell me if there's any treasure on any of these platforms. That's a problem. 
This one clearly doesn't have treasure, and I'm disappointed. That's the one thing. So, that's uh, good to know. But for now, it's off to Tingle. It's Tingle time! I think this is how you do it. No, that's not right. Tingle! Yeah, see, look at this. Look at this, though. I have almost... Oh, I have that one quarter of the map completely done. Also, another Triforce... A Triforce piece is on Outset Island! That would make sense, actually. But... Tingle Island. Tingle Island, here we come. Tingle Island, here we come. Tingle Island! Man, I didn't like that show. Because isn't that like... The OC, that's what it's called. I did not like it. People really liked it for some reason, though, but... I don't know. I don't know, man. It's been a long time since I've seen anything about that. And that is a good thing. And all was good. But Tingle, please tell me your wares are cheap and will help me get rid of my pocketbook problems, which I have, I just have too much money burning through my wallets. I mean, it's, whenever I pick up money, it burns through right into the ground and into, and into oblivion. It opens up another dimension and the money just disappears. It's very disappointing. So Tingle, please help me. Oh, Mr. Fairy, I've been longing to see you, sir. What should we play? What what, what do you want to play? What, what? You're not here to play, are you? Um, oh, that's fragment, that's musty scent. You, you, sir, you must have found a chart. Splendid, splendid, Shelby. Shelby! Oh, look at that. Look at that jiggle. That's the reason. This is the whole reason why Wind Waker HD had to be made. Because they wanted to show people this in HD. Oh, Tingle. Mmm, yes. <laughs> Why? You can't just... You can't just read that chart on the, its current state. Impossible, sir. Would you like for me to decipher it for you for 348 rupees? 398 rupees, that is. Sure, that's actually nothing. 398? You call that a lot of rupees? Tingle, Tingle, Kulimpa! Become readable! You got your chart deciphered. You can now use it to find a place of the piece of the Triforce. Look at your chi chi charts on the map screen to check its location. I cannot speak properly right now, but at least I can do my announcer voice. Hmm, Mr. Fairy, you must uh, try... I, I was almost going into small fry with that, but I mean, small fry in this is not that different. Anyway. But this, Mr. Fairy, you must try very hard to find the treasure. When you select and open this chart on the map screen, the place where the treasure will, will shine forth. Then you must go to that place and rely on your chart to help you find the treasure. Okay, uh, I'll do that. I still have 600 rupees. I'm probably gonna get up to a thousand, like, instantly. Look at this. Uh, I was gonna find 400 rupees right in the grass there. Just imagine. Can you just imagine? I know I can, and it's terrible. Absolutely terrible. Uh, platform chart, Beatles chart, Triforce chart 2. Triforce. Wait, I don't have a Triforce chart. Seriously? That doesn't tell me where it is! That, that kind of looks. If I go too south, too south from here look like it might actually be the place. Oh, oh, I, I might have just got even more wet by jumping into the water. You know, things happen, because when Tingle's around. But what I need to do, go south one, grab the fish, see what he has to say. Then, from there, I need to... What the heck is that in the sky? There's just like four points of danger and separation. Okay, where is the fish? Where is the fish? Fish me! Um... Ah! Oh, see, those things are... Just harmless. They don't do anything to you. Ah, oh, here we go. There's the fish. The fish will tell me what's in this location. It seems like it's just another pirate island. Pirate land. Oh, good. He was close enough. I only have one bait thing left. I really need to go to Beetle, like, instantly. Instantaneously, we're going, Hi, small fry. Yeah, yeah, I've heard. This island is made out of danger and many, many rocks. Which are not very good. 
Let's see what this is. Yeah, it's another pirate place. It's Pirate Bay yet again. Oh boy. We're gonna be leaking Game of Thrones again. Have you seen those weird rings of light that appear in the seas at night? Rings of light? Are you meaning like what I just saw in the sky? There was just like aliens coming to attack me? I don't know. Ha haven't you? Yeah, well, those things are sure are a sign of that there's treasure in the deeps, Fry. But let me tell you, there's not. There are some lights that don't always shine. Yeah, there are some special ones that shine like crazy, but only when you open its treasure chart. They say that those mark the spots where the greatest treasures are hidden. And that's all info I have to offer. Yeah, because uh, those ones that light up the, the sky are very evil. Yes, evil. They're very easy to tell, and those are the good ones. I don't know what I was going to go with that, but I can find it. I can do it. But I don't know. They're not just at night. The, the treasures are everywhere. They're everywhere, man. I see them just like when I'm driving by in my Honda Civic. I don't have one, but, you know, I, I think that I do. And that's the main thing. Also, that was a treasure that I just went pie. Went pie? Okay. Where is where's the island? I think the island is right over here. This island might just have treasure on it. Treasure Island, please. Oh no, I think... According to the Triforce Chart 2, this is not the right place to go. But you know what? This is a place to go. Probably dealing with... Wait, 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 wait! This is a Triforce Chart! This is a Triforce Chart! It's right here! Where is it? Oh no, I, I missed. It's right... It's like here. See? Do you listen to that noise? It doesn't show up. It's invisible. But you know what? There's a reason why it's invisible, because this is the most important thing in the world. And if anybody ever found a glowing circle on the ground regularly, they would be cheating! Yes! You've got the Triforce Shard. Now you only need six more. Okay, and also on this island they might actually have something here too. I didn't get to check my Triforce chart while I'm doing things, because I'm, I'm just grinding along the side of this good old-fashioned island. So, wow, those pirates really like to friendly fire each other or something, because they just keep getting killed and just smoking. But, yeah, islands can be good old-fashioned because, you know, they kind of are... They've been here for a long time. Depending on when they were created by volcanoes and, and stuff like that. So they probably would be mostly like all volcanoes. I need to check though. I want to check my map now. Uh, incredible chart. Oh! Oh! So when you actually do get something decoded... Oh, I probably should have grabbed those 10 rupees. Because they're only 10, not 100 or 200 or whatever it should be. But it does actually tell you on the thing. So this is this is another Triforce Island. It appears as though it is. So, oh man, this is there's another chart to the one corner next to this one too. This place is just like riddled with Triforce pieces. Maybe there's a reason that the person's when they were just breaking up the Triforce, they were just really lazy. They're just like, oh, we're just gonna scatter it all within like two feet within each other. Oh, this is another one of those battle rooms. Ah, I can do that. Also, I really need to check where Beetle is later. <laughs> Beetle chart. Beetle isn't in a lot of places other than just, like, up north. It's kind of depressing. Also, his, like, armored twin brother of Beetle is, like, two squares up and left. So, it's good to note. Good to note. And I'm going to denote that everyone's going to die, hopefully, here. But this is also a really good place because I can probably get 400 rupees just by breaking these pillars down if I have to fight the big guys in there again. Hopefully I will. Hopefully. Oh no, 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 no. I only have... Oh. I gotta just quickly run over here. Break that. Break that. Break that. Okay, there we go. Explode for me, good sirs. Explode into oblivion and into... Preferably more pieces of uh, arrows, because I kind of need like 
50 more arrows. Maybe like 56. You know, around that. I don't have like any arrows left. And I don't know if you can really kill those guys if you don't have arrows. That's the one thing. I don't know. See, that place you would get screwed if you didn't have arrows. Just like that one area that actually had bomb flowers but didn't at the same time. Oh. So like all of these challenge areas have different kinds of enemies in them. At least it seems like it. I'm just going to spin around in circles a bit when, uh, 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 ow! He mildly hurt me and poked me with his stick. That's, that's very disturbing. Please, just stop poking me with your stick. Okay. Uh, that's, at least I'm getting a bunch of rupees again. Oh, and ten arrows. That's gonna save me later on. But still, like, the rupees are just so abundant in this game. Because I'm already up, up to 620. Already. I'm probably going to be up to 700, 800 by the time I go back to Tingle again. No problem. Then you can play the... Oh, no. Then you can play the game. Play the game. Play the game. Play the game. Oh, no. I can't hit you when they're that high up in the sky. Okay. If he appears again, yes! Yeah. At least these guys, I think, are just ones that don't spawn enemies. That's the one good thing about them. I'm not entirely sure, though. I think- I'm just gonna assume that I actually just did that good enough and quickly enough that I- I just didn't have to worry about it. Nah. They were going to spawn stuff. But I was just that good. If I already- I only needed one more. I thought that I- I had much more of a challenge here than this. Come on, guys. Let's do this! I can kill all of you in like five swings. It's like one of those challenges from Captain Toad's Treasure Tracker. Uh, did I grab this? No, I didn't. I might as well get the joy pendants because I think they actually do something. I've read something online before that they do something. They do something. They don't seem very useful to me though, actually. They still are not the most useful thing in the world, but they are kind of at the same time. Die! Um, that makes things so much easier. Oh, he actually is getting back up. You you dare get back up after you have no armor? And no sword? Actually, what? Oh, no, no, no. Gotta ba backflip out of here. Oh. I want your rupee, please. There you go. Oh, man. Friendly fire inboard from the, inbound from the north and the south and everywhere. It's friendly fire. It burns very bright, unfortunately enough. What the heck was that? He's trying to do, like, a roundhouse kick on me. Oh. He's going for the other sword for some reason. Oh, no! I was gonna grab that quickly, but... Oh! I didn't press my dodge fast enough. He just keeps... What, what the heck is going on here? He won't stop attacking. There's something wrong with him. His AI is broken, man! Is that it? Yeah, it is. Okay. Just holding my big sword. Two hand in it, you know. Swing! There we go. Now, I'm glad that when you, like, walk near your door, it doesn't just, like, break you in. Because if it did, oh, that'd be bad. But yeah, look at this. Look at this. So many rupees to be had. The golden encrusted towers of legend are going to be broken down this day. And then, hey, hopefully, if they actually do have something amazing, which... They might just do that. Is oh look at all those ones. But if you break down all of these, and hopefully like a, a chest will appear in the middle, just going like, hey, you actually get something amazing too, and so on. I don't know. I got nothing. Got nothing. This is the correct one, right? I mean, it had a fancy little door, so unless the fancy door means exit, exit here, please. We don't want you in here anymore. You killed all of our uh, inhabitants. They spent good money. That's where all those rupees came from. That was their rent for the night. And for many, many nights, actually. Because that was a lot of rupees. Like, 200. You got a Triforce Shard. Now you only need five more. Oh man, there's so many of them. So many! And so many rupees. Oh man. 
And I don't know why still people, like, unless they, like, changed the game when they actually did make this into the HD version for Wind Waker. If people ever complained that they didn't have enough rupees to deal with Tingle's charts, they just aren't playing the game right, I say. Unless they're trying to speedrun it or something, then they're just like, well, I don't have any rupees because I I haven't done anything in the game. I've just sat around and twiddled my thumbs and did absolutely nothing. 